Next, I'll be introducing Josh Bezzi. Josh is a member of the PTL FC, AUPAFT. Josh is a part-time lecturer in the Rutgers Writing Program, and they were laid off at the end of the fall semester after 10 semesters as a PTL. They first began teaching in the writing program in 2007 as a graduate student, and they received their PhD in English at Rutgers in fall 2016. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. Um, so I just want to begin by saying that I love Rutgers. Um, as was mentioned, um, I am a proud Rutgers alum. Um, I received my PhD in English at Rutgers. I began teaching in the writing program as a graduate student in 2007. And since then I've taught 10 semesters as a PTL. And I keep coming back because I love teaching Rutgers students. I choose to teach even when the work of teaching is undervalued and unfortunately it often is. I love Rutgers, but Rutgers is now choosing to devalue its educators. Over the decades, the administration has devalued educators by replacing secure and permanent positions with more and more PTL positions, effectively pushing us educators into precarious underpaid working conditions. Now Rutgers devalues educators by casting of us off in the middle of a recession. Last semester, after supporting students throughout the spring and fall semesters of the pandemic, we learned from an unceremonious email that PTLs would be laid off. Despite efforts by full-time faculty to stand by PTLs and reverse this, Dean March stood by the decision. I am now unemployed, navigating the seemingly endless red tape of New Jersey unemployment and unsure of how to move forward. I want to continue teaching. I love teaching, but it's now unclear what my future holds. We who've worked loyally for the university for many years have been treated as disposable and unwanted. I've looked to Rutgers not only for my livelihood, I'm invested in Rutgers and the student body. I love teaching English and writing in Rutgers and I'm good at it because I've done it for more than a decade. So why would Rutgers lay off people so dedicated to the university? If this was about job performance, it would be understandable, but I personally have received glowing reviews from my students and from my supervisors. That's not the excuse being given. Dean March has used COVID and the recession as a cover to lay off PTLs as a way to balance the budget. But how is laying off underpaid educators like me a meaningful way to balance the budget? We do not have to sit idly by as, as if the purging of PTLs were inevitable. President Holloway should not sit on his hands as educators at Rutgers are being devalued and as loyal workers are being humiliated. This is offensive and hurtful. We are real people we have real qualifications, and we need to speak up for educators who work on the front lines. We're living in a time when the fabric of our democracy is being eroded. We can continue to stand by and watch it happen, but I say we need to value education as a civic good. To do that, we need to start valuing our educators. President Holloway, I hope you can hear this. Thank you.